Hey guys, my name is Adam Carmichael and I'm the founder of Winner's Edge. Let me take you on a short journey of how the Winner's Edge got started. I was born and raised in the northeast of England, a far cry from my current life here in Bali, but we'll get to that later. I grew up the youngest of two siblings, achieved decent grades at school and went on to study sports science at university. Whilst at uni, my family thought I was doing this, when in reality, I was doing this. After graduating from uni with a ton of debt, reality started to kick in and I found myself working part-time in retail shops for minimum wage, in between humbling months on government allowance. I was 23, feeling trapped and lost with nowhere to go and nothing exciting to look forward to. Then came the moment that went on to change my life. In March 2011, one of my friends randomly came across a website called Sharkscope that displayed the winnings of the highest earning online poker players. Excited by what he saw, he rang me to ask me if I wanted to give poker a try professionally with him and his brother. This sounded like a crazy and overly optimistic idea, but as I had nothing else going on in my life, I said I was in. Oh, and I've got to mention, this was taking place in Thailand. So I put myself a one-way flight and off I went. After a few months of grinding $7 heads up sit and goes, we were able to make a small profit and thought that maybe we had the potential to become good players if we took it seriously. There were no safety nets and after grouping together every penny we could get our hands on, we formed a joint bankroll of around $2,000 which also had to cover our living costs. Throughout the first three months we almost went broke on multiple occasions but soon the 12 hour days were starting to pay off and we established ourselves as $60 regulars. We relocated to Bali and it felt like it was going to be smooth sailing from there. Then, out of nowhere, disaster struck. The lobby registering software that all the regulars were using made some drastic changes and started giving all the lobbies to players that had the fastest internet connections. Being in Bali on a ridiculously slow connection, we couldn't compete with other regulars and our income literally went to zero overnight. So we packed our bags. Next up, Lisbon. We had limited space in the house so we grinded from the basement, which at times felt like a prison. But on the upside, I was now playing $300 games regularly on my own roll. Finally, I was able to pay off my debts, and I vividly remember the excitement when my bank account reached 5 figures for the first time. Fast forward to 2013, and I was back living in Bali with a good internet connection, and I had my first 6 figure year. I had played 66,000 heads of singles, making me the 5th highest volume player on the whole site, hitting Supernova Elite in the process. By 2014, I was on cruise control. I hit Supernova Elite again, and at this time that I realized I need to start setting my sights higher if I want to achieve bigger and better things. So I set myself a new goal, to be financially independent within two years so I could walk away from poker on my own terms if and when I wanted to. In order to achieve this goal, I would have to move up to the daunting $1,000 level, which at the time was regarded as on lockdown by most players. However, I was determined to make it happen, and I spent the first half of 2015 battling the best players and heads of sit and goes to earn their respect. After an 8 month battle, I finally got accepted into 1Ks, which had some of the highest earning potential in online poker. This is what I had visualised and worked so hard for my whole poker career, and it really was a life changing moment. Over the next few years, I was able to set myself up financially for the future and create opportunities in my life that I didn't think were possible. At the beginning of 2017, I started to notice that I didn't have the same passion that I used to for poker. The money was great and I'd achieved most of my goals I set out to, but it just wasn't fulfilling me or exciting me like it used to. It was at this stage that I knew I needed to reset my goals and focus on something more than just the poker grind. Fast forward to mid 2017 and I was now ready to start the next chapter of my life. I threw myself into learning everything I could about self-development, mindset, goal setting, peak performance. I was reading books, listening to podcasts, attending seminars and training, everything I could get my hands on. The next six months were a real transition for me. And after lots of reflecting, I realized that I was doing things very differently to almost all poker players out there and that I had developed unique approaches to poker that I could teach the players to dramatically improve their performance. I took all of these approaches and developed a system that incorporated three essential components that are needed to achieve your full potential as a poker player. This, my friends, is the winner's edge. After working one-on-one -on -one with hundreds of ambitious poker players, I'm excited to share with you the key foundations that you need to master in order to reach your full potential and gain the winner's edge. So what makes up the winner's edge? The first of these is what I call your performance edge. This is where you create a systemized approach to poker which has you getting the best of yourself on a daily basis. At the start of this phase, you have to create a crystal clear vision of the future of not just the goals you're trying to achieve, but also the life you're trying to create. After setting big goals, you then break them down into achievable checkpoints. Plan out the key action steps and set up monitoring and evaluation systems that allow you to know if you are staying on track and what you need to improve on. To get your performance edge, you need to work hard on developing the habits and routines that are in alignment with your goals, as well as overcoming any bad habits that are holding you back. 
Then comes developing your mental edge. Now, despite poker being an extremely technical game, it's often mindset that makes a difference to those who really excel and those who just get by. Mental edge involves you learning how to stay in control of your emotions no matter what poker throws at you, overcoming tilt and any negative belief systems that are not taking you towards your goals. Once you've stopped being the victim in your life, you can now be the creator of your future, positively moving through your days, knowing that you're mentally strong enough to handle any challenges that come your way. You discover how to keep yourself motivated and energized on a daily basis, whilst maintaining the highest levels of focus during your grinding and studying. All areas of your life will change once you develop your mental edge, as you'll now see every obstacle as a challenge to overcome and a way to grow. And then comes your lifestyle edge, an area that most players neglect, but that you won't. This includes everything from the foods you eat, your daily exercise practices, how you maintain your energy levels, your stress management, your personal growth, and even your overall life balance. This is about living a high performance lifestyle that has you feel energized and able to perform at your best on a consistent basis. Once you master your lifestyle edge, you will know that not only will you be able to achieve your goals, but you'll also be able to maintain your success over the long term whilst enjoying the process. So if you are interested in learning how to get your performance edge, unlock your mental edge, or fine tune your lifestyle edge, then you've come to the right place. There's videos and articles here for you, and those who are serious about taking the performance to the next level, you can apply to work with me one on one by the coaching link above or even become a member of the Winner's Edge Club community I designed for you. The Winner's Edge Club is a coaching membership site in which you have access to the highest quality content and where I walk you through a step-by-step -step process to take the three areas you've just learned about above to the next level. You'll be joining a community of ambitious players dedicated to reaching their potential. And you'll have me as your coach every step of the way. I created the Winner's Edge Club to educate you, inspire you, and hold you to a higher standard in all areas of your life. You'll be joining a community that's there to help and support you through all the challenges you face both on and off the tables. Every month we learn new habits together and every other week you can jump on a live coaching session with me and have all your questions answered. For more information on what we've got going on inside the club and how you can join us, just click on the link below this video. I hope you enjoyed this video and I look forward to helping you develop your winner's edge.